Hey Gators, hope everyone's doing well. And I hope that you're having fun and um, you're adjusting to the online school and kind of maybe starting to enjoy it. I know that the online school thing for me was a bit of an adjustment. As you know, my technology is not the greatest thing ever. Um, but I'm actually starting to have fun with it and enjoy it a lot more than I, I was in the first couple of weeks. So um, I just wanted to reach out and say that I think you're all doing really great and I've been really impressed with the work that I've been getting so far. Um, and before I go over the week at a glance for you guys, I kind of wanted to introduce you to someone. I did a thing today that I thought that I would never do. Um, so I'd like to introduce you guys to Lewis. This is Lewis and he's my new horse. He's a really sweet boy too, huh? Huh, you're a good boy, huh, Lewis? So, um, he's gonna be the star of some of the upcoming videos, so stay tuned, because there's much more to come from us. Here we have our week at a glance for urban agriculture, and that's for the week of May 4th through the week, uh, through May 5th. Um, so the priority standard that we're going to be covering this week is PS2, which is demonstrating an understanding of animal production utilizing humane, ethical, and sustainable practices. And so this week we visited the vet um, over at Plateau Veterinary Clinic, and they specialize in livestock. So we took the girls over there and we had them ultrasounded to see if they were pregnant. So definitely check that video out and see who's pregnant. And the vet does a really good job explaining um, anatomy and physiology with the ultrasound machine. So it's pretty cool to watch. Um, then you're gonna review the dairy goat management PowerPoint and utilize it as a reference for the dairy goat breeds project. And so that brings us to the dairy goat breeds project. So complete the dairy goat breed project by selecting one of the dairy goat breeds and entering the key information into the text fields on the template, which is attached to the canvas assignment. Um, so just think about um, what goat produces the most milk, which goat has the highest butter fat, um, temperaments, which one looks the best to you, which one would you choose if you were gonna pick a breed to raise? So it's kind of fun. Um, and then I'll be giving written feedback on any of the projects that are submitted. And parents, you can support your student this week by asking which breed of dairy goat did they choose? What, why did they choose it? And have them present their poster to you. Um, and my Zoom office hour, this, well, it's every week, but um, they're always on Wednesdays from noon to one. And there is the link to the meeting. The meeting ID is right there and the password is goat. And feel free to reach out to me before then if you have any questions or concerns. Um, my email and my Google Voice are all on my, uh, my Canvas profile page. Um, and feel free to reach out if at any point you need anything. I'm pretty quick at responding. Um, have a great week. I hope to see you all submitting your projects next week. And I really look forward to reading over all of them. Um, this is one of my favorite projects that I assigned. So have fun with it. I look forward to reading them and have a great weekend.